Hi, I'm Jim, and this is Chase. And as you can see, nothing's changed. <coughs> Except, of course, the size of our belt buckles. Today, we'll be making for you chili cheese fries. Delicious. You'll need some french fries, some generic chili, some jalapenos, Cajun seasoning, and a good glass of scotch. Also cheese. That burns. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're gonna start by opening with a knife. No, wait, hold oh, on. This will do the trick. Ah! There we go. Ugh. And while JMO preheats the oven to 425 degrees, I'm gonna lay these bad boys in. That is, that is freezer burnt. As we like it. You know what? You can just cook that. That's that's part, that's water fry right there. Put that on there. Yeah. You're gonna want to wash your hands thoroughly. Almost forgot. Lols. You're gonna want to spread the fries out evenly so you don't get clumpage. You don't want clumpage. No. So, well, we're waiting for the oven to done. Oh, it's already done preheating, I think. Oh wow. And we actually live in 2012. Yeah. It's they the have future fast ovens. It's only a year from now. Yeah. Okay, so okay. I'm just gonna pop these in. Pop them in. How are we baking these bad boys? Huge. Remember to read the instructions. Trash. Remember Huge. to read the instructions. Um, uh, ten to twelve minutes. Go. Ten to twelve. In the year twenty twelve, we have rotary dial ovens. It's a retro. They heat up fast. Okay, so... Well, the first thing you do... Get out of the pot. What's up, man? And... Can over it. commercial messages. Does your dick get cold in the winter? Are you constantly getting hit in the junk? Is this frustrating you to no end? Then it's time for you to get with the program and get a dick helmet hat 4G. The dick helmet hat 4G is sturdy enough to handle any shot to the wiener, but also soft to the touch. Comes in stylish black and camo. Call now and we'll send you our festive dick sombrero absolutely free. Call today! And we're back! I got the chili open with the can opener and not the samurai sword. And we're just gonna put the chili inside a saucepan to simmer slowly. Yeah, right. Look at that. That's just nice. Future ovens are irritating. I don't think that's even nearly halfway out. Just nope. Just... <laughs> yeah, as, you can, as you can see, it's stuck in there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there you go. Show that to the camera. What you end up with is a big can shaped wad of meat. Remember the guy from uh, Hey Arnold? He had like a can head? That's him right there. Not football head can. <laughs> Gerald, I believe his name was. Okay, so you're gonna let that simmer. You're gonna stir it. You gotta, you gotta break up the meat chunk. You gotta break it up like that. Uh, oh my goodness! Looks like my poop. Yes, 
it does. So you just kind of like stir that every once in a while. And our fries are done. So we're going to get out some oven mitts. I'm the state of Michigan. <laughs> uh oh. I'm going to have to move this tea kettle. Typical. Ooh. Golden. Bam. Do you hear that simmer? That's the sound of deliciousness. Hold on. Sample. That's gonna burn your mouth. Uh -huh. mm. Stop looking. Okay, so while the fries are still hot, we're gonna add some Cajun seasoning. Because, you know, everything's better back in the bayou. Just sprinkle it on like it's a glitter on a unicorn's back. Mm. Ride the rainbow, baby. You don't need to see this. Oh, He's got a secret wrist technique. And we got it down. And while we're waiting for the meat to heat, we're gonna go to another commercial. Time for the Beast de Resistance, the Coupe de Gras, the finished product. Mm -hmm. We got your fries here. Make sure to grease your pan, by the way, because we didn't. You just kind of gotta get, scrape them off. Gotta like, scrape the fries off. Oh. As if, as if they were somehow stuck to the pan. Yeah. And just, just put them all over. The plate's a target. The plate's the bullseye, really. Just do your best. Yeah, because you know what? You're making these, it's probably not gonna be in your kitchen. So, it's up in someone else's kitchen if you want. And you know, if you wanna have a fry here or there, no one's gonna tell. I sure am. Alright. Next, I'm gonna slowly saute the chili on. And make there. sure I'm standing here watching. Yeah. You can contact Chase by calling him at his local phone number. possible to make this that one. Yeah, that's why we're doing it for their eyes. This is eye food. I carly. You don't put it in your eyes, you look at it. Yeah, don't stupid. make the don't make the same mistakes. Steven be Tyler. stupid. Steven Tyler tried to make these put in his eyes. That was a man thing, woman. He's in Tyler Perry comedies right here. And once you got the chili on the fries. You add the cheddar. <laughs> Throw some cheddar on that. Bam! Bam! <laughs> Shazam! I just want to pinch it with an oven. Woohoo! Yeah! Bam! Okay. Chase, take it from here. Okay. We're gonna need a fork. A fork? Where do we put the forks? I always know where your tools are. Usually, you're Forking gonna up. need a fork. As tools. Now, diced jalapeno peppers from the elusive Mount Onion. 
not really a loose it's different play. I believe it's in Fiji. No, that's Mount Fiji, I believe. Okay. Let's see. Smell how spicy it is. And you don't have smell vision. Mm, it uh, smells like my grandpa's toe. Yeah. I'm missing. How many jalapenos do we want in this? Four? Probably, I'd say four or five spoonfuls. Yeah. And. Alright. Twist a kick. Twist a kick. Twist the twist. If you want, you could probably add some onions or some bacon. We don't have either of those things, so we're not going to do it. But here is your finished product. Completely vegetarian with chili. Hmm. I, do I like these? Yeah. Yeah. Dig in. And remember, if you take one up and it's connected to other loaded fries, that's one loaded fry. And the end.